attack and wait on McCann's 11 away. Wildy waits. We'll play the ball now. Comes down this short side. Ball turned back. There's John Davis, who's come into the action for Bussey, who's gone off with the HIA. Ford now gets it away. Strong carry back to Ford. They've got numbers now. They're going for the corner. Gareth Gale reaches out. And Gareth Gale has just opened the scoring for Featherstone Rovers. 15th of the season for the big man on the wing. And finally, York's resolve is breached, much to the delight of the Featherstone faithful. Put to the ground. Featherstone, whose season ended in the semi finals last season, they want to go above and beyond that this time, and they look well set, unbeaten at the moment. Will the oh hey well, there's a kick out there from Fitzsimmons and Briscoe now and there's pushing and shoving something happened there he's on the ground oh there. wow <laughs> that for me should have been a red card the other way he's not meant that he's not meant that he's been let go and he's yeah. Think, yeah I agree with you Kev I think he's just trying to rip his arm free and he's just caught one Fitzsimmons in the face and he's reacted he's reacted to it which is I think that's why Scott Michalowskis Mark wants to fight us he, he, he disagrees do you think he meant that? <laughs> Fitzsimmons unlucky to be in the bin but sometimes in life things go against you and it's against York at the moment Sim bidding there and the one thing as the ball goes out and it's dealt with, the one thing to be fair to the referee, he said, look, whatever's happened, you can't react like that, and he's right, he's exactly right, you cannot kick out, no matter how bad the injustice, as the ball now going forward with Springer taking it forward, Springer's over the line, and he's overpowered York, and Gadwin Springer's electric start to the game continues with a try, he's over, he's third of the season, and Featherson lead by eight. To that man on picture, regardless what's gone on previously, You've got to make that tackle. And look to get involved and get people fit at the right time of the season. As now here they go, and a chance almost through the line there for York. It was Josh Daly who took the line on. They're going down the short side. Jesse D trying to reach out, and they have scored. Clinical stuff from York. One chance, one try. And they were cheering when they were conceding tries. Now they're cheering because they've got one of their own. And York have hit back. Ten points to four. To its intended target cleanly. Lacanz gets it away to Smith. He puts the brakes on. Wrapped up, picked up, dumped to the ground. 12 out from the line. Featherston looking threatening, but they need points now. Lacanz kicks through. Host of blue shirts coming. And they've got it down. Mackenzie A has scored. He went crashing into the boards. But they couldn't stop him. And Featherson's decision to turn down the two leads to a try. 14 points to four. Jack Bussey takes over the kicking duties, and Jack Bussey thumps it through the post and over the stand away behind the goals. And it is 16 points to four. Left out, do they? They don't want to give Sean Long a reason to leave them out as Morse comes forward again. Lovely pass to Ford. Ford flooding through the middle. Couldn't quite find the support. Brad Day was with him, last one for Rovers again, they're coming left here. Aikens wrapped up, needs to find an offload, Moores is there running round. Moores gets it, Ankins and oh. flick past the Gale, what a try! Wow, acrobatic finish, but what about the pass from Hankinson? The York defenders just fell away, and Gale is over in the corner, 20 points to four. Looking around, here's Hankinson, he's wrapped up. Last one. Ball here to Ford, who's going to kick it high. A midfield bomb here. Is this going to be caught? No, it's not. And that's going to be another set of six. And here come Rovers now. Ball wide for Gale. Gale steps and he's going to go in for the hat trick. Gareth Gale cuts it off the left hand side. York don't deal with a high kick. And Gareth Gale cashes in. Three on the night, 17 on the season can't get the players on the field, and when they do, they can't keep them on the field. Good to see players getting injured, hopefully back sooner rather than later. Here's John Davis, Davis up the middle, looking for the offload, they find the offload, and now they're flooding through. Anyone of four, they're in, Connor Jones scores! Under the post, celebrates 
for the Fenderson fans. And Rovers are running riot. Here in York. Here's Pussy. Surely this time, Jack. Yeah, this time the flags go up. 30 points to four. Now here come Featherston, Lacan short pass. They're trying to power their way over on that far side with Bussy. He's wrapped up. Numbers to the left. Jones to Davis. Davis to Ford. He'll stroll in. Try Featherston. And now they are cutting loose here. Yes, there'll be better days ahead for York. We can all be certain of that. That's the extras, 36 points to four, and it's just all getting a little bit fast now, isn't it? Areas throughout a training week all manifesting to it. Well, here's a kick over the top, and they're after it. Will Brown get a bounce? He will! What a try! Brilliant bit of skill! And if ever anyone deserved a try for York today, it's that fella. Joe Brown is over. It's only a consolation, but it was a bit of brilliance. And finally, the York fans have got something to cheer themselves. And finally, a little bit of luck for York. The bounce to the ball. You fully expect it to bounce straight over his head there, but here's the kick. The kick is good. 36 points to 10 now. Glover adds the extras. He's now back on the line. And here they go again. Going through the hands this time. Little step from Aikins puts the foot down. He's wrapped up a meter away. Jones looking for options. Fires it to Lacan's. Little step. Lacan's going to dummy his way over. And Thomas Lacan celebrates by kicking the ball into this crowd. And he's over for his fourth of the season. The little half back. Third, fourth gear quite quick and, and fell over. Yeah. Ball swings back to Jug, gets it away, Barnard will carry it, he's inside the, around about five metres away, Jug looking around, can he find a gap in this defence, he'll get the ball away, taken in, big shot goes on Daly, but he bounces it off, and Daly, can he get there, oh it's a great finish, Daly reaches out to score, and that was a hard earned try from Josh Daly, and the York fans up again, their third try, Daly with a try then, here it is, fired it through the middle, James Glover, 40 points to 16, and again, great to have him back, Ford is going high, again, this time he's kicked away, Tao so he's underneath it, the youngster does well, but he's oh. lost it, picked up here, and a chance, is it going to be a, another try for Gale, he wrestles his way out, he's over, four tries, for Gareth Gale, and they will have the final word. 18th try of the season for him. Bussy strikes this one through the middle, and it is 46 points to 16 here.